What's up guys, on Ninja Wearing Aviators and the Superman had bring you another episode on the combat or ah, I guess this is not combat for dummies. Ooh, oops. <laughs> but so this is gonna be another random video on the Modern Ninja channel. So uh, I want to start doing more random videos, and uh, if you have any ideas for me to do random videos on this channel, just send them to me in the comments. But a little bit ago, I got uh, kind of roasted and yelled at for using fake weapons in a lot of my tricks and stuff like that that you guys have seen. And uh, I have three things to that. Number one, most of the time I use a bow staff, and you can't make a fake bow staff. A bow staff is literally a stick. So. Uh, I don't know how you can make a fake bow staff, but my hope is that you mean the swords and the weapons and the blades, uh, the bladed weapons that I use. Uh, and no, I don't use, well, yes and no. I do and don't use fake swords. Uh, so my size, those are very real. They're metal, they are sharp at the, at the tip. Uh, <clears throat> I did dull them at the tip, but they're still metal. They're still, you know, solid objects that will hurt. Uh, but maybe that's not good enough for you. Um, guys, let me be real with you. I use uh, aluminum and dulled swords for my tricks and stuff because it's safer. Like, it's just, that's just, it's safer. And so uh, that's why I advise for you guys to practice with when you're trying stuff out. Don't go and buy a real sword and then try to do some of the tricks that I do and end up you know stabbing yourself in the chest it's not fun and so here's the thing uh, to prove you guys that I not only can do tricks with real swords but I'm not afraid to it's just you know a personal preference uh, I'm gonna do tricks with this real sword this is stainless steel it is sharp uh, it's not the sharpest blade I've ever had, but it's definitely sharp enough to cut if I, uh, you know, try. And this tip is <laughs> very, very sharp. So, <clears throat> here we go. I'm gonna do a couple tricks with a real sword. Don't try this at home. Definitely don't do that. My dog keeps eating grass and regrets it every time, but then comes right back out here to eat more grass. I don't, yeah. I know you're leaving. I can see you. It's because you eat grass. <laughs> you gotta learn. She has to learn. She's not gonna learn. She's not gonna learn. Here we go. Alright. Let's do some some combos. One, two, three, four. That's, you know, some simple stuff, but that's not really the blade handling. And this kind of stuff is where you handle the blade. The stuff where you toss it behind you and catch it stuff like that uh, again I'm not afraid to and then you can really get interesting when you decide to do your hand rolls Woo! almost messed that one up when you decide to do your hand rolls with catching the side of the blade so whoop. yeah yeah buddy oh man this is not smart at all again don't do this at home I wonder if I could do two sticks. Uh, let me try that one more time. Almost, almost, hang on. Oh yeah, I can do it on this side. There we go, two spins right there. And that horizontal spin as well. Maybe a full horizontal spin. There we go, like that. So guys, again, I can't stress this enough. Doing this with real swords, super dangerous. I just kind of wanted to prove that I could uh, for all of you guys that have been getting on to me about uh, using real weapons, because I've had had a couple, not a lot, but a couple, and so I figured I'd stop it right now. So, with all that said, I hope you guys like this video. Again, if you like this video, leave a like down below. And if you want to see me do something else stupid or random or funny, whatever it is, let me know in the comments. Now. Until next time, make sure you like this video and subscribe to the channel so you can see the next one. My name's DJ Moore, this is The Modern Ninja, and I'm out.